G'day. Welcome to this episode of Epic Drives Western Australia. This time, we're off down south to follow a river, a big one, the Blackwood River. It's 300 kilometres of southwest goodness, all wrapped up in off-road adventure. So kick back and come along with us down the mighty Blackwood. Our journey starts 170 kilometers out of the city down Albany Highway to a small town called Arthur River in the Wheatbelt region of WA. Roughly 50 kilometers southwest of Arthur River is Wild Horse Swamp. It's here that the Blackwood officially starts. And as we travel down a dirt track, we get our first glimpse. The river is most probably named after Vice Admiral Sir Henry Blackwood, who died aged 62 in 1832. He had quite an interesting life. Joining the Navy aged just 11 years old, he was a lieutenant at 20, a commander at 23, and post captain at 24. He commanded several vessels during the French Revolution and was well known by Lord Nelson. After years of seagoing warfare, Blackwood was given command of the newly launched 74 gun ship HMS Warspite in 1807. It was on this ship that a young man by the name of James Sterling was transferred to Blackwood's ship. 21 years later, this man, now known as Governor James Sterling of the Swan River Colony, named the Blackwood in honour of his commander. The colony, at the time, was just 11 months old. The river makes its way towards its first town, Boyup Brook. Initial exploration of this area, then known as the Upper Blackwood, was marked by a surveyor's benchmark cut into this tree by Assistant Surveyor Sir Augustus Charles Gregory during his first journey through the Blackwood district in May 1845. After crossing a few picturesque bridges, we arrive in a town that claims to be the country music capital of WA, Boyup Brook. With the amazing and completely crazy Harvey Dixon's Country Music Centre here, this place is well worth a look around and is a great place to camp, if you're into country music that is. We continue further downstream, winding through the hills and farmland, to Bridgetown. Many buildings in the town centre are over a century old. This town got its name for two reasons. The first is obvious, simply the fact that it's surrounded by bridges. And the second is that Bridgetown was the first ship to carry wool from this district. The town has a population of just under 2,500 and was established in 1868. Continuing down Brockman Highway, we take the less frequented roads following the water. We come across this beautiful little spot for lunch. We take to the hills and come across this spectacular track with a perfect view of the Blackwood Valley.
eventually we roll into Nana. There is a caravan park here if you're towing one, and it's the perfect sleepy town to stop in for the night. The population here is just 501. The area was initially known as Lower Blackwood before a bridge was built and the town was officially gazetted in 1885. The sun was getting low on the horizon as we pulled into a campsite known as Barabup or Workers Pool. Unfortunately, being that it was a Saturday, the place was full, so we off-roaded down a quiet bush track to a nice spot on the side of a hill and made our camp for the night. The next morning, we were up early after a good night's sleep. We packed up camp after breakfast as the locals were wanting it back. We took our time through the bush, enjoying the scenery along the way. We only had about 80 kilometres to go until we reached the end of the trip, the mouth of the Hardy Inlet at Augusta. And there we were, our final stop for the trip, Augusta, complete with a couple of dolphins to greet us on arrival. There's something powerful about following a river from start to end. I guess it's a nice symbol. The river's many sounds suggest the sounds of all living things, and the flow of the river, as well as the fact that its water is continually returning, suggests the nature of time. That's it for this episode of Epic Drives Western Australia. I hope you enjoyed it. Join us next time as we go south once again, this time following the Warren River and tackle Kalkup Hill. Mm -hmm.